I am I come to Epworth because it's a it's where I belong. I don't really feel like I belong entirely at work. Um, it's an extension of my family and my connection to the community and um, it's where I feel safe and whole. Come because my parents they um, make me come every week except when I can't come and also I come because I get to um, participate in the youth group and then I, I make friends at church too. What's valuable for me is the variety of different people that we have in the congregation and not just flavors and colors but also ages and, and perspectives and I like what that brings out in myself as I relate to those people. Um, recently my mother passed away two years ago and we had lived with her for over 30 years because she could not take care of the house by herself and one reason she wanted to be in this community is because it was close to her friends and family of which Epworth was part and even though she was confined to the house basically for the last six years of her life people called her, people wrote cards, she called them Every Sunday I had to bring home the program, I had to bring home the newsletter, <laughs> and she would tell me, please tell somebody about this, tell somebody about that, and I had to report everything. Heaven forbid if I forgot something. I come to church because I come home, and I come to my family, and these are my people. And it's a lively community, a fun-loving community, a community that's serious, though, about social justice and um, doing making a difference in the world. Um, most important to me though, which I can hardly speak about, is that it um, welcomes everybody. All means all, folks. All means all. And we shouldn't have to define it, but we do apparently have to say that that means all sexual orientations, gender identities, all families of whatever form and definition. And that makes for a very vibrant community, a very lively community, and that is Priceless. And that's what I always bragged about to my friends when I was growing up, was that, you know, well, my church is a reconciling congregation, so it doesn't matter who you are, we accept everybody. So I always wanted to make sure people knew that my brand of Christianity was one that loved everybody and really did what Jesus taught and accept everyone for who they are, whether they're poor or straight or black or white or whatever it is. So that was an important lesson growing up. If I hadn't gone to church growing up, then I would be a totally different person. Like, um, church introduced me to community service, it introduced me to, I guess it made me more social. And it's cool to come here and see people that I've known since I was three and who remember me as like a little baby and they always comment on how I've grown or how different I look or how different I act. And then it also gives me like a safe place to play my flute or do things like express myself because everyone here is just like, yeah, go Aaron, you can do it and stuff. They're really encouraging and fun to be around and stuff. My hope is that um, we are going to continue to grow community by going out and during the shelter dinners and by going to Nicaragua and by and just by having fun with one another the way we've had on the bike rides, um, our bike team for the MS fundraising that we've done together really came out of Epworth, and I and I think we've brought people in <laughs> that way, and I think that um, to grow community would be the biggest hope that I have for Epworth.